hey what up decisive marketers where we run our business every now and then we got to meet clients or meet our team members and finding a suitable time slot for the meeting uh, or for the appointment uh, is not easy sometimes right because you got to find uh, an availability for yourself and for your um, the person that you're meeting and that's what today's tool is going to help you to solve by um, you know allowing you to set your free uh, time slot so that others can book on you and uh, you know you can set up appointments very easily uh, with this tool itself okay and today's tool is called pro booking right uh, it's a appointment scheduling tool uh, and it's going to help you uh, you know you can do paid uh, meetings you can do free meetings as well uh, and there's a lot more other features that is built in uh, but before I dive into pro booking be sure to hit that subscribe button if you'd like to see more digital marketing and e-commerce content so here we are in pro booking okay with pro booking um, you actually get your own booking page that looks like this of course it's you know it's not uh, up yet I you know I, I just you know put a uh, just a random logo in there and uh, with uh, you know you can actually put some text in here and I'm going to show you how it looks like uh, right here so you have the booking page right where you can um, customize it Okay, so this is the booking page right here right and you can put your welcome message so it's a very simple uh, booking page right here okay so you can put your name uh, profile image the welcome message and you can set your own branding as well so you can set your own username so you get your own page like this okay and your brand color so the brand color I guess is you know pretty much just dictates uh, this this uh, text right here okay and some of the buttons right and uh, you can set the uh, font type and if you want to you can also set up a custom domain right so you can have something like uh, so you can have uh, you know book me dot decisive marketer dot com something like that okay so you can have a booking uh, page and then you can put your brand logo uh, in here as well right so this is the booking page so you can set it up something like this okay so first thing let's jump into the uh, settings right here okay so you can set you know what kind of language that you want so with pro booking uh, I would say that there are two four bookings is actually very um, very powerful right now um, and hence they are actually even at the point where they are you know translating the two so that you can choose between different languages uh, for uh, pro booking itself right so they are already uh, you know five languages that is supported you got English Spanish French German and Czech right and then you've got Italian Portuguese and Dutch that's coming you can set the date format and the time format and what's your time zone right and uh, so once you have set this up then you know we can jump into the uh, overview right here so you can see what are your upcoming appointments and uh, what time okay and these are some small analytics for yourself to know uh, how many meetings do you have this uh, week what's the total number of bookings that you have already uh, monthly how many you have and the number of clients that you have Okay, and uh, what kind of appointment types? So you can set up different appointment types. By default, it gives you the uh, 15 minute, 30 minute, and one hour consultation, right? And you can copy this, uh, and you can send this out to someone very, very quickly through Pro Booking itself. And you can create new appointment types as well, right here. Okay, so you can put the appointment name, the uh, location, right? Is it a physical location or uh, maybe in your office or, you know, it's an online meeting on Zoom or Meet or you can even use, for example, uh, you have you use uh, Triveta, right? So you can create a schedule on Triveta and you can copy the link in here so that people can just sign up uh, with, uh, as in enter the room. Uh, using Triveta right here as well right because this location will be sent to them okay and the uh, appointment schedule right so you can set up your own schedule okay 
so uh, you can set up your schedule right here so this is under the availability tab right here so you can put the name uh, the name for this av uh, availability and then you can set the uh, availability from what time to what time right and uh, you know from Sunday to Saturday right and then uh, <coughs> and certain days that maybe you are not available you can manually add them to remove them from the slots right here okay so maybe you have your own personal events that you got to attend to right you can remove those availabilities e uh, easily from here or you can just you know uh, set a manual override right okay and uh, you got your appointment description if you want you can put a video as well so you can have a youtube or vimeo link and your appointment type image and if it's a paid appointment so uh you know it's an offline appointment or you know it's a you know online and you know they can pay it's whether they're paid offline or via stripe or paypal or stripe or paypal Right, so you can choose. Uh, you can set that up. You can put the pricing and um, whether you want to hide the coupon code section. Okay, <coughs> hide the coupon code section, and then the appointment settings. So uh, the time zone display. So this is the default time zone that your client will see. Okay, so automatically you will detect uh, and show the visitor's time zone, or you can show your default time zone. Right. So this is based on your own time, okay? <coughs> so uh, next is your redirect URL. Uh, so once they complete the booking, do you want them to be redirected somewhere else, right? So you can set that up and whether you're gonna allow them to cancel or reschedule, right? So you can do that uh, through pro booking right here. Okay, so let me just put in something right here <coughs> and then the appointment settings whether it's a one-on-one -on -one meeting or <coughs> a group meeting okay if it's a group meeting how many people will be attending and then the uh, duration okay and uh, availability uh, so uh, how how far in the future can they book the appointment with you right so uh it shows 100 days so you can book maybe you know uh like a month in advance or half a year in advance or a year in advance so you can set that up as well and the number of meetings per day that you can have right so 99 for known limit okay so you can put that up as well so this is the number of bookings you can have per day okay so uh so that means if you have more than let's say let's say if you put 10 meetings so if you have more than 10 meetings per day then it's uh you know uh you can book so people can book on that day itself uh anymore right and then the uh, interval right so how long is the meeting uh, sorry interval will be uh you know uh like ev you want to show this time slot um, every 30 minutes or whatever it is okay and then the buffer time so once you have a uh, slot okay so let's say if someone books at like what they say here right from 3 to 3 p.m. then you will add a 30 minute buffer so the next time slot that is available would then be uh, 4 p.m. okay or 2 p.m. so 2 p.m. or 4 p.m. right so it's, it's got to be like 2 p.m then uh then to 2 30 then 30 minutes break then 3 p.m then to 3 30 then 3 30 to 4 would be a uh, another break so those uh that will be the timing right so you have a buffer time and the notice period right so notice period make sure that you have the adequate time to prepare for a new meeting if you set four hour notice period you won't be bookable without a four hour warning so notice period will be like if i want to book a meeting with you then how early do i have to set that meeting right be uh, no one can you know meet me way in advance right i said like not not way in advance but like the last minute right so i can't say like i, I just book you uh 30 minutes before and then i want to see you right now okay so you got to have some uh buffer for your notice period so you can set that up as well 
and then the uh, custom booking form so you can actually ask uh, a couple of questions right so you can put put in the question and ask uh, ask them okay and then they will fill it up okay so you can add multiple questions and uh, you know you can have a text field to fill in you can have a radio button a checkbox a text area a drop down so these are the fields that you can set up and the next one will be your custom uh, you can set up a custom uh, confirmation email okay so this is uh, how the email looks like so you can set up your own you can even design the email and you know paste in the HTML code to um, design it and then you got email reminders okay so these are the email reminders SMS reminders okay which is coming soon it's not ready yet and then you've got your cancellation emails and reschedule emails and uh, follow-up emails okay so after the meeting you can also set up a follow-up email okay so these are the ones all right and then you can check out all your appointments in here okay and uh, let's let's jump into coupons first before the integration right so, so you can set up coupons for people to use okay and uh, you can set based on what kind of appointment types can you use this coupon on uh, valid from when to when and uh, you know the discount or a uh, you know absolute amount okay and the value and the limits on the coupons right how many times can it be used okay right so next is integration so integration wise uh, you have Google Calendar right and then for meetings and payments you've got zoom Google meet okay so these are the direct integrations uh, but of course that is a custom solution so you can use something like Trivetta for meetings as well then uh, you got Twilio uh, which is coming soon that integration you got stripe and PayPal okay and they also have uh, you can put it, put uh, tracking codes on your booking page right you can put uh, tracking codes on your booking page so Google Analytics Facebook pixel Google Tech Manager and uh, Microsoft uh, I give I guess this is Microsoft clarity and then you've got uh, webhooks right on booking right you got you can have three different webhooks uh, to be triggered right here so you can actually connect with other different apps such as Pebbly connect okay so next is uh, we have the let's jump back into the booking page right so with the booking page let me just take a look okay so and um, let's see um, I believe that they have a embed option so let me just uh, look for that embed in your website okay so uh, so you can embed the uh, booking option right so when you jump into the appointment type okay that is the gear icon and you can just add to website and you get an iframe code to make use of okay so um, that's about it with pro booking uh, I don't really have much to share about this this is their roadmap um, so they've got Portuguese and Dutch coming custom fonts right, user-friendly time zones Outlook calendar integration okay then one-time event uh, you got SMS reminders uh, meeting location right that your client can set and uh, video description for booking types as well so that's going to be added in uh, Zapier uh, integration partial payment right so you can actually pay up front first then you know during the meeting you can pay for the rest right you can have a round robin uh, you know if you have a team members as well and shared availability and uh, packages so they can book multiple appointments at once and recurring appointments so these are the ones that is planned or and coming up in pro booking um, the only suggestions that I would say is the coupon um, 
possibly we can limit that to a specific user as well right or uh, you know limit to number of use per user as well right so I think that would be a great option so uh, so let's say you can put in an email and only the person with this email can use this discount and also uh, if they have a uh, um, let's say uh, let's say you can have a one limit on number of users right so unlimited number of users but one time per user right so you can set up a coupon like this as well so I think those are the only two uh, suggestions that I, I would make to pro booking but otherwise I would say that it's a very um, complete solution in my in my opinion um, right and uh, I think that their layout is very clean and nice uh, for the booking page so I don't see I don't see uh, I mean the the style that they have is, is just a clean booking page that's about it and I guess that's all I have to share about pro booking right let me know what you think about pro booking in the comments below um, if you need, uh, if you know anyone who could benefit from a booking solution, alright, be sure to share this video with them. And lastly, uh, if you enjoyed this video, do give me a thumbs up. I'll see you in my next video.